learning something new is easy. The only thing easier than that is not starting at all. I was out working in my garden today. Now this garden was started a long time ago. This garden has also had seasons where it's looking hella sharp and hella well groomed. And then this garden has also had seasons where it's looking kind of rough. When we, when we decide to start something, it's really fun because it's new. It has the newness thing. And that's with any pillar of life. Start a new eating habit or start a new exercise or start a new side hustle or start a new main hustle. Start doing something new in your current relationship or just straight out start a new relationship or start not having a relationship or start something new that will help develop you. But the moment you start it, it's not very long before it loses its super duper shininess and it starts losing its luster just a little bit. This happened just like my garden. The day we started it, oh man, it was super exciting. We got to go out, go shopping. We picked up flowers maybe, we picked up mulch, we picked up soil, we picked up wood chips. I don't remember, we just picked up a bunch of cool stuff. And this is true when anybody starts a garden. Maybe you buy a new shrub or a new little tiny cute tree. It's fun, it's exciting. You get to use your tools and maybe your brand new gardening gloves. You're wearing your apron maybe, or you got your shoes on that you're gonna use exclusively for the garden. You're out there having a good time. Maybe you got the little wireless speaker, you got your favorite songs going, you got lemonade or iced tea or whatever your drink of choice is. Maybe a little straw and an umbrella. You're just enjoying it because it's new. But then weeks go by and you start finding out that some plants didn't make it. They're nice and brown and dry. You also notice that that little cute tree that you bought and planted, well, it's, it's lopsided and a lot of the leaves are not looking as vibrant as they did when you bought it. You also notice that the new soil that you bought is maybe not that dark brown. It's more shooting to maybe like a gray. It's dry because maybe it wasn't watered as much as it could have been or the days were real hot. And magically, some stuff you didn't really plant just started growing all over the place. I think they're called weeds. And it just seems a little hotter that day. Not that nice breeze and oh, it's just a warm day. Kind of like the day when you started the garden and the enthusiasm is not there. The motivation, the energy, it's just not the same as it was that very first day when you started the garden. And that's because it's lost its newness. When we start something new, know that it's going to be really fun when you start. It's supposed to be. So make sure you enjoy those moments. But the real goodness is in the long-term process, in the marathon of things, in the maintenance. When you're doing your research on anything new that you're gonna start, make sure you also search up the maintenance, the how to maintain that thing that you're starting, how to make it work long-term, what to expect in the next three days, three weeks, three months, three years of this new thing that you're starting. What does it take? How much time? How much effort? How much money? This way when you start, you already have a really good idea what the long-term plan is gonna look like.